Hi guys and girls, my name is Andy from the Angel Share in Inverness. Uh, seeing as we're all stuck at home at the moment, we thought we'd bring a little bit of our questionable whiskey chat to you from the comfort of my living room. Um, so what we're going to be chatting about today is going to be the Ben Reik 10 year old Curiositas. Now this is easily one of my favourite drams for a couple of reasons. It's entry level, huge bang for a buck, and it's a little bit techy. Um, you know, the reason it's a little bit techy is what these guys are doing over at Ben Reik is they are malting their own grains. And the significance of that means that they can cone it however they like and they can malt it for as long as they want to impart the peat that they do in this dram. Um, it gives them complete and full control over what the end product is going to be from start to finish, which is an absolutely fantastic way to go about whiskey. Um, so this has a huge wisp of peat to it. It's also finished in three different casks. So it's got bourbon, virgin oak and rum. So it's a really interesting combination, really rich, lots of vanilla, lots of fruit going on. Um, for me, on the nose, pretty much the first thing you notice is going to be peat. It's fairly obvious when it comes to a peated dram, but you get a lot of fruit, you get some honey, and you get a little bit of oak and marshmallow as well, which I think is really cool. Um, it is quite a full-bodied dram, as you can potentially see. Where is my camera? It's here. You can see how oily it is. It's really nice and full-bodied. A little bit of water will open this bad boy up, but seriously, drink your whiskey however you like. You can have it with ice, have it with water, have it with Coke. It really doesn't matter. The age of having to drink it straight is over. Now, for me, I do like to drink it straight. It gives me a little bit more of a sort of full character and it lets me sort of see what's going on a little bit more. Um, so we'll go ahead and give it a little taste. So PT straight off the bat. Lots of vanilla, some heather, it's nice and grassy. There's a real vibrant fruit note going on as well, which is absolutely delicious. Finishes really strong on kind of dark chocolate. It dries out and you get a little bit of kind of fennel towards the end. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, if this gets you excited, you've got two options. You can either wait until we reopen, and I would absolutely love to see your gorgeous faces coming into the bar. Um, give you all the tasty bevies, all the tasty food, and all the questionable chat like this. Um, but if you can't wait, I think this does retail for about £39 from Master of Malt. Very important to stay at home at the moment, but you may as well enjoy it while you're there. Um, so, I've been Andy. I don't know why I've been Andy. Drank a little bit too much of that. God, it's far too early.